this is a word for you this is a word for you you will know you will know yeah this lighting is because it's very let me show you guys yeah that's what i'm doing with right now so we must remember that the devil is not going to sit back and allow us to take new ground without putting up a fight okay that first word was already powerful anytime we make progress in the building in building a kingdom of god our enemy is going to come against us but james 4 verse 7 says that he will flee if we resist him if we resist him let me grab my highlighter many times we make the mistake of trying to use faith to get to the place where we have total freedom from trouble what we do not realize is that the purpose of faith is not always to keep us from having trouble it is often to carry it is often to carry us through trouble if we never had trouble we would never need faith Although we are tempted to run away from our problems, the Lord says we are to go through them. The good news is that he promises he will never have to go through them alone. We will never have to go through them alone. He will always be there to help us in every way. He tells us, fear not for I am with you. I've been saying that a lot. Fear not for I am with you. In our daily experiences, we must learn to stand our ground and run the devil off our property and drive him out of different areas of our lives. Learning to be stable in hard times is one of the best way to do this. Remember, the devil will oppose you, but you have the power to resist him and he will flee. I have no comment. The more I practice these faith, keeping my faith stronger and stronger. I actually saw this on Instagram. She's a psychologist and a brain coach. So with fear, actions erases fear. So when you take action, when you take a leap of faith, it what's it called it drives out the devil i am not perfect and because i'm not perfect that's when we need god no one's perfect nonetheless that shouldn't get me to run away from god who created me and love me unconditionally so in in that case i'm going to celebrate my life today because it's another beautiful day thank you Thank you for starting a day with me. This is beautiful. Jay. Hey, what up, y'all? <laughs> hey, guys. Miss Nia, JK. I feel like I should be drinking my pre-workout because I'll be working out on legs today. Today is leg day, baby. It is leg day. Oh, I also need to take my clothes out of the dryer and take my trash out because my trash is full so much and this is why we write things down y'all this is why i write things down being an adult can be like overwhelming and sometimes you just need to write it down and that's all it takes is to write it down and it will solve everything I'm just 
king. It's so good. And then start the day because now it's sunny outside and we're gonna make this day count. <laughs> I ran out of socks because they're in my laundry, so I have to go down and get my laundry. Yeah, yeah, I gotta do that. Mm -mm. Yep, I gotta wear a specific socks for my fit. You feel, you feel, you feel the drip. You know the drip. literally running and my bun my bun keeps hitting the freaking roof That was a phenomenal meeting. Yeah, it was nice. Now, go home. I need, oh, I need. Grab what I needed. This is what I'm cooking. I am making spam eggs and rice tomorrow. The Filipino style. Here. You can speak to him in French. Go talk to him. Hi guys, come over to me. Come over to <laughs> Come over to The eggs and the, the spam. Thank <laughs> you. 